we're back again and today we are talking about how to rank in Google so most of us want to rank high in Google actually we want to rank on the first page on Google so how do you improve your rankings so most of you have websites but you have keywords you want to rank for because that's where your clients are searching for that's how you can find clients and that's how you can also build brand awareness so how do you improve your rankings for the keywords you want to rank for in Google if you just want to rank just overall for every keyword that's a very 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 difficult one but specify the keywords you want to rank for first before you think about ranking in Google because Google is a search engine that everyone's using all over the world so if you want clients to find you you have to use Google and if you want clients to find you easily actually you can pay for Google search ads so the search ads work properly but that's a different strategy and i'm not here to tell you about buying ads what today i'm talking about is how to help you rank without spending a lot of money and even though you spend a lot of money in search ads the thing is your website may also not rank organically or also just not rank at all first of all you have to understand is that google is a search engine and everyone is using it and everyone wants to rank so it's so competitive so how do you stand out from the competition what do you have to focus on without breaking the bank you have to focus on keywords that are related to your business don't focus on keywords that are not related to your business because even though people find you using those keywords they will not convert so imagine i'm searching for milk and you're selling milk but you're not ranking for milk you're ranking for shoes or you're ranking for cows so yeah cows is related to milk but of course if i'm searching for milk i'm not going to type in cows i'm going to type in milk so first of all think about the words you want to rank before you do anything regarding ranking in google the other thing you have to understand is the website how is your website is your website mobile friendly is it mobile responsive so what i mean is mobile responsiveness is if i'm using my phone can i really view your website completely the same way i'm you know viewing it on a desktop will it actually you know convert the screen into a mobile you know mobile device will i be able to search or will i be missing a few pages or will i be looking at half of the content that's on your website so that's also one of the things you have to understand if your website that isn't responsive it will not rank in google because because most of the searches are done on mobile devices actually 90 percent of the searches recently are done on mobile devices so you have to make sure that the first thing you do is also make your website more by responsive so that people can also find you using their mobile phones otherwise your website will not rank in google the third thing you have to understand is you also need to have a ssl certificate what do i mean by ssl certificate most of you build websites with http without security so http you can also have a website people can visit you it doesn't mean that your website is not good enough but your website isn't secure imagine you're collecting people you know collecting information from you know from um clients would you want their information to be unsecure if people are signing in and where the, the information goes and all that so it's not only about if you're collecting information not collecting information if you're selling stuff but your website has to be secure so that your content isn't hacked and that kind of thing so it's very crucial also to google that you rank only when you have a SSL certificate so SSL certificates can be bought if you want one you can hire a developer to install one for you you have to buy one first and install or you can buy a whole package to be installed so that's a different topic and uh, the fourth thing you have to understand is 
you have to have content on your website you have to be writing new content related to the products and services you're offering if you want to rank in google and i'm not saying just keep on writing and writing and just uh, sticking in your keywords keyword to keyword not that what i'm saying is just write relatable content and build you know and make sure that it's related it flows don't just write content that doesn't flow and expect to rank and last tip i want to give you in order to rank in google is use google search console google search console will help you improve your website will show you exactly what words you're ranking for and what's wrong with your website and it will also show you exactly what's going on with your website and how to improve it if you use that tool it will help you a lot improve your website and with no time you start ranking and last but not least i say that was the last tip <gasps> let's recap because now i've given you a lot of tips and i don't really know where i started but i know they'll be very helpful because they have been helpful to me and they have been helpful to lots of my clients so what i want to recap is first of all like i say to you you have to specify the keywords you want to rank for that's number one otherwise we google also won't know what to rank you for the second thing is you have to make your website web responsive the third thing you have to have an ssl certificate the fourth thing is use google cons uh, console to improve your website and the fifth thing i think i should tell you is try to install plugins such as yours to help you with your seo because they will help you build the perfect website for you to rank though they'll actually direct you on how to use this you know how to you know how to write content for your website so i think those are enough tips five and if you need help with doing these things and you're wondering maybe you're doing them wrong or you want to consult with us or you you know feel free uh, contact us in the description link below leave us a comment or if you know you already doing the things and they're not working for you leave us a comment and tell us no these things are not working for me or if you're already doing the things leave us a comment to say yes they work for you and please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to tune in every week for tips and tricks on how to improve your business online yeah and that was it. See you soon. Bye.